This is BBC One. We're interrupting our programme for a BBC News report. You're watching a BBC News special, reports of a shooting outside the Palace of Westminster, outside the House of Commons. A policeman has been stabbed and his apparent attacker shot by police officers in what is developing into a major security incident outside the Houses of Parliament. These live pictures of Westminster Bridge where eyewitnesses say a car, in the words of eyewitnesses, mowed down several people, some reports suggesting as many as 12 people injured uh, after a car hit them and then was driven into the railings of the Palace of Westminster. Many people being treated at the scene as you can see from these pictures on Westminster Bridge. Hello, we have interrupted our usual programmes this afternoon with some breaking news. There's been a serious incident outside the Houses of Parliament. This is the scene right now in Westminster. The Commons leader, David Liddington, tells MPs a police officer has been stabbed and alleged assailant shot by armed police. We will be back with the latest at 6.15. In a change to the scheduled programme this afternoon, we now head over to the ITV News. Good afternoon. We're interrupting the normal schedule to bring you a special programme this afternoon. Several people have been injured in an attack immediately outside the Houses of Parliament. A police officer has been stabbed and his alleged assailant shot by armed officers. This is the live shot of Westminster Bridge from the helicopter, which has been over the scene for some time now. We're being told the incident happened in New Palace Yard, which is the green space within Parliament's gates at the foot of the Elizabeth Tower. We may get the shot of that very shortly as you see the helicopter moving across. In addition, it's reported several other people are injured on Westminster Bridge just a few yards away as we were just seeing a moment ago. Police have sealed off the area. Parliament is in lockdown while the security services deal with the situation. So as you can see, there is now a huge security cordon being extended around the Palace of Westminster. Uh, incidents still being dealt with on Westminster Bridge itself. 